All right. Dutter cut, which uh, is uh, taking the wool pad with some compound and trying to rub off the scratches. In this case, this car had a lot of water spots and I took previous videos to show it. Okay, the method that I use, I use my Makita buffer, the wool pad, and heavy duty cutting grease. I didn't already see the first step, but we should, we should protect with the wool pad, heavy cutty cream, and my Makita bumper. Across the front bumper, the whole head. The driver front fender. Both of the drivers front and rear door. I did the driver front mirror. This post, half of the driver top. From here to right here is where I stopped. I buffed this. I buffed from, from the top of the hood on the driver side all the way across to right here. And I gotta go on the other side and buff what's, rip, what's left of the top. I buffed this pillar. I buffed this whole quarter panel right here. I done buffed the whole trunk. And I had section off the trunk to separate the difference between what part I buffed over here to the left and the part that I didn't buff over to the right to show all the water spots and the scratches. I buffed the back of the uh, trunk, the uh, back bumper, and it's a Lexus GS300. I buffed this pillar this and to right here from the passenger uh, real quarter panel over the passenger's uh, doors and the passenger side top you can see the water spot still in it I haven't buffed those yet and I haven't buffed this pillar that's what I'm going to buff next Right now I'm on the uh, passenger front fender. I done already gave it a cut, which is the first step. Peace. 